Hi, I am Jennifer Soma and I am the face behind GH High Schools. So I'm sure most of you have been placed in your various senior high schools and you're wondering what do I pack as I'm going to senior high school? That is why your big sister is here to help you out. So let's get right into today's video. We are talking about the things to pack and how to pack when going to senior high school. So I'll be looking here for some of the tips because I don't want to miss anything. So firstly, you know when you get admitted into the senior high school, the first thing is the school is going to give you a prospectus. I'm sure by now you know when you're supposed to go in for your prospectus. So when you get your prospectus, there are lots of things that the school would require you to bring and those are compulsory things which is peculiar to every school it, it would not be the same thing for um in front of him it would not be the same thing for at this school or any other school so the prospectus would give you specific things the school needs you to bring yeah so that's the very very first thing you need to get your prospectus from the school that you've been admitted to but before i go on just in case you are here and you didn't get the school that you wanted to attend maybe you didn't get an a a class school and you got a b class school or a c class school or whatever it is that you got please don't be discouraged and think that because you didn't get your school of your choice you are not going to do well or you're not going to succeed or you're feeling so bad because your peers got their schools that is a wrong thing to do let me tell you something it's very good to attend a good school no doubt about it but what is very 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 the best thing is going to a school and achieving something coming out with good grades coming out with good values so wherever you find yourself you can still achieve whatever plans that you want to achieve if you put your mind to it so don't get discouraged because you didn't get your preferred school I want to say this before I go on okay don't be discouraged just go to school have fun learn and come out a better person that is very very important so now let me talk about the other general things that you would need aside the perspectives the school is going to give you so there are, there are general things like in the trunk mattress shop box and all of that you will need a pillow you will need your toiletries if i say toiletries i mean your soap your um tea roll ladies your sanitary pad your brush comb body cream hair cream deodorant all of those things for your personal hygiene you will need all of that and also you will need maybe a small umbrella or raincoats in times of the raining season it's very very important you don't want to walk through the rain to the dining hall you would need that and also you would need bathroom slippers um a bucket pail you know obviously for bathing and all of that and very important you need thread and needle it's very important because as you're in school when you get any fault on your uniform or something it would be difficult to maybe have access to um a seamstress or a tailor yeah maybe there are some schools is really really available but i don't know just get a thread and needle for the times you need it so urgent in the morning you're going to school and there's something wrong with your clothes also you will need it a torch light is very important and about first aid well i think you should get um painkiller and maybe um um maybe um something for your tummy in case your tummy hurts it is not really allowed because um their school um maybe sick base and all of that school clinics and all of that i i advise that if you can and you know how to administer like medication well you know how to take paracetamol you know how to take um maybe magazine and all of that you should get some in your bag for emergency sakes maybe and mind you are having a headache a terrible headache and you can't have access to the school clinic at the moment at least you have some first aid on you that would help you it's very 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 important and you will need cups cutlery yes and plates cutlery very important for your dining hall i'm sure that some schools will specify what kind of cutlery they would want you to bring i don't really know but i'm sure spoon knife um fork and yeah all of that is necessary you place your cup and that and also you would need to take along stationery yeah your pens pencils erasers and all of that for your class um works 
and all that exercise book notebooks i'm sure that that would also be stated i don't know but you should get ready you should get a lot of pens trust me because <laughs> the bonding house those are things that can easily get messed in like going to class and you have just one blue pen for the whole term for the whole term sorry then <laughs> you're not ready to write because it would definitely get messed in. so make sure you stock up a lot of pens pencils and all of that extra exercise books extra um notebooks so that you can be able to go through the term successfully and okay so let's talk about the things you need to pack talking about the provisions that you would need in school so these are some of the basic things that you would need to pack and the very 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 important you should get shito as you're going to school you can eat shito with gari gashets i know gari shito by my school use the gashets i don't know if it, whether it sounds right so you're going to use your shito for your gari and all of that and in some schools i don't i think they are allowed to take shit out to the dining hall so you i don't know for your school but you should have shit out in your chop box very very necessary and you will need biscuits and not just any biscuits you will need piccadilly biscuits shemima this is not an advert but trust me shemima will be your savior ha that biscuits when you get it and you add it to some um this thing tea or something is very very good and essential it's like your savior so you don't have to go to school without taking biscuits especially shemima and also you will need chocolate powder which is the milo the chocolate and all that so you can prepare some um cold beverage as mine maybe you want to sleep or just you know just to chill out and all of that and you would also need sardine or corned beef or mackerel depending on your preferred taste and this one is going to help you complement your gari and your shito to add some extra you know nutrients to it for you for you to feel so good you can add a bit of ketchup to boost the whole look and taste very 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 important and you should also get um granite for your gari soaking that's your gari with um milk and water you can just use that to you know up the taste and all of that you can get drinks maybe calipo canned drinks like your preferred taste so that sometimes when you're there you're hungry it's not your dining time you just want some things you want to sip on you can get a drink and just sip on that very 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 important you can also get conflicts just to spice up your chop box so you can have a variety of things you can eat when you are hungry and don't forget to take sugar also to add to your conflicts your milk on in any other thing that you would want to take and i just want to say this don't take unprescribed items any item that has not been stated in your prospectus please don't take them unless there are things you know you would need them genuinely don't take them please don't take things that are not prescribed it's your first day in school you don't want to get in trouble it is too early for that at least for the first time when you go don't take and then don't take a lot of things that are unnecessary because you don't even know what you're going to meet but when you spend one time at least when you're going back the next time you know oh okay i think i needed this but i didn't take it so now i can take this or i took this i didn't need it so let me just get this instead you get it don't pack a lot of unnecessary things i'm sure they will let you bring most of the things back home if you do and please no unprescribed items it's very very important you know what i'm talking about those things you've been taking to school don't take them to school i won't mention them but you know yeah don't take unprescribed things so aside all the things that i've mentioned i know there are some basic things that you would need if i didn't even mention them you should just sit down write down all the things you think you would need for school then start purchasing them i'm sure some of you have already purchased most of the items you would need so just purchase them or write them down and then get them gradually and all of that i don't know when you're going back to school but as you go back to school i wish you all the best subscribe to gh high schools i'm going to give you updates and information on all senior high schools in ghana and i'm sure you don't want to miss out on it so thank you for watching and share to your friends and family and let me know in the comment section what school you were admitted to so that you can maybe you might meet one or two people who are going to the same school as you guys can 
quick before you even get it. So thank you so much for watching and my name is Jennifer. So I'll see you in the next video. Bye.